YouTube. What's good? I'm coming at you guys with yet another video. And as you guys can see from the title and the picture, uh, we're going to be talking about Timothy Bradley Jr. and how he uh, vacated the WBO welterweight uh, belt. So you know, uh, Timothy Bradley, he vacated the belt. He was uh, unable to fight uh, Saddam Ali, teaching him uh, fighting Manny Pacquiao. Which, you know, uh, Saddam Ali was his, uh, mandatory for the WPO belt. Which, you know, is pretty much understandable because, uh, that fight with Pacquiao will bring in, it, that's a bigger fight and, uh, it's gonna bring in, uh, more money for him. So, you know, pretty good decision, uh, by his part. You know, you know, he basically, uh, wrote a letter, uh, to WPO saying, <clears throat> and I quote, uh, this is from, uh, Timothy Bradley. As you know, I will be fighting Manny Pacquiao on April 9th, 2016 in Las Vegas, Nevada. To accept the, this fight, I cannot comply with my mandatory obligation and must forego the mandatory against Saddam Ali. This is a difficult de decision, but one I have to make to give fans the best fight best fights as well as allow myself the toughest and biggest fights possible from both a competitive and financial perspective. I'd like to thank WBO. Well, you don't really need to hear that. So basically that uh, title fight will be uh, Jess Vargas versus uh, Saddam Ali on uh, March the 5th on that undercard of uh, Luis Ortiz. You guys know that uh, Vargas faced Timothy Bradley and lost uh, convincingly, you know, unless until that uh, last round, you, know, you guys know what happened with the rest and all that. I don't think he would have knocked them out anyways, but you know. so pretty much we don't know why uh, Manny Pacquiao and Timothy Bradley are fighting again, except for the money, of course. Uh, you know, now this, this fight is going to be, uh, it's going to be less because they were gonna fight for the uh, WBO title. Now there's no title. Pretty much they're just doing this for the money, I guess. You know, uh, good for them. You know, they're giving their money up. So what do you guys think of the situation? Uh, did y'all think we were gonna strip them, or you know, you know how some of these uh, belts, uh, you, you know how uh, they do. You know, they be bending rules to get their favorite fighters. And what not, sometimes they don't even strip these fighters or make the, the mandatory, like some bonds and shit. So, yeah, go ahead and uh, comment on this video. Like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. Go back to all my other videos. Yep, yeah, thanks for everyone who's watching. Peace. Let's do more videos.